nothing. So just drop shield down to that. So Russ could have gone for a little bit safer shield pressure, and it wouldn't have, that wouldn't have been an issue. But probably gonna see Fox versus Mark. I think. Yes. Yeah. yeah. I think Vox has got a slight edge in this matchup. Marth has a tough time dealing with rushdown characters, which you'd expect in like archetypically, like uh, you know, like a Zona versus a rushdown. Uh, you'd expect the rushdown rush to have an advantage, or, like uh, by good game design, you'd expect that to be the case. So. Three, two, one, go! Putting up shield, putting down shield, you know, he doesn't yeah. want to waste his shield, like, let, he wants to wow, just... It's super low. Yeah. There it is. What? It has a punish. Right. Oh, oh I respect that. <laughs> um, interesting start to the game. All right. <laughs> but we're still going. Yeah, you know, if you get a little shield break, you might as well make it a <laughs> Yeah. He does back air to cover like a ledge jump, and but he's uh, moving forward, so it also covers well with the up tilt. That's a lot. Oh, I think he was holding out as well. <laughs> yeah. He's dead. Just too low. Brilliant. Yeah. All right. Basically, that tipper up smash from across the stage basically got him the stock. <laughs> That's dead. Yeah. Just once again demonstrating how tough it is to get back on stage. And small, especially. Yeah. Doing a really good job of getting him off zone, which is obviously what you want to do. And Fox is a really is really good at it. But nice, it's a lot of damage. You don't want to hold shield too long on the ledge against Marth because they can always just Go drop down yeah. shield breaker. Yeah. Nice. All right, doesn't get a follow up there, but off stage. Yeah, it's really hard for Marth to cover the side B back. Uh, oh, but he's doing a really back good job. Right. Nice, That's, that should be it. Yeah, yeah. To, yeah okay. Wow, oh, you're just... doing everything in his power to stay in. Wow, do you want... Yeah, oh, that's it. Ooh, yeah. I like the counter, but... Yeah, it's it's just one option, basically. Yeah. If you don't get it. Nice. Awesome plays. Yeah, I, I expected Set Out to be out of recover, like to cover all of Juan's recovery options, but Juan managed to like thread the needle and get through, yep. and then uh, seal the stock from it. So uh, very well played. Three, two, one, go! Back to the stage. Oh, I did. Nope. There we go. Just, Just gets in so easily with the up tilts. Yeah. There we go, that's fine. Yeah, cool. Again, damage. Alright. So the mix up when Marth does side B on your shield is that uh, they can do the third hit before you can shield grab, but you can always shield grab between the third and the fourth hit. So basically it's a mix up between hits one and two, or if they're gonna do like, uh, like if they do one, two and stop and you're expecting the third hit, then you won't get a punish, but there we go. That's just such a good edge coverage though. Um, the last couple of times, Sad Howard had jumped from ledge and got caught by back air, and this time he tried to roll and just go and be ready when up smash. I've seen a lot of people, a lot of foxes go for the forward there drag down. Um, it hasn't worked out for any of them, the other contestants always checked, but. That works. Yeah, I like how Sad Howard's play right now. He's okay. Wow! I'm surprised. That must have two frames. I don't know. That was a really weird hitbox. But that worked. That worked. Nice, perfect shield. Uh, rolling back to get grab. Yep. So, Sad Out were trying to cover like the on stage side B, and Jordan's like, now nah, I'm just gonna ledge. No, yeah, dodge? Alright. Cool. 
traits. Oh, I like that option, the F smash. If you're on air dodges, that'd probably be a stop. As soon as the third hit comes out, that's a money. Oh, it doesn't get the last hit of the down air, so it doesn't confirm. No roll, only just slot up. On platform though, it's kind of rough, especially on the ledge. There you go. He's got a couple of options, you know. He can try and jump, he can try and roll, but Jordan seems to have his number every, every time he got the ledge. He's just calling out the right options.